Hello, my name is Lillian Kwan Dick, and I would like you to know that the month of May is Asian Heritage Month. So it's time to remember and celebrate Canadians of Asian heritage. And this year in particular, I wanted to honor Chao Quen Li, who is a Chinese Canadian hero. She passed away recently at the age of 105. And when she was 80 years old, she was the test case for a class action suit against the Canadian government over the Chinese head tax. Now the Chinese head tax uh, was applied in 1885. At the time it was $50, then it became $100, and then it became $500, which was equivalent to two years salary. Now, Chao Quen's future husband came to Canada in 1913, so he had to pay $500 just to get into the country, which was an enormous sum of money. He went back and forth to China three times, married her, they had three children, but because of the Chinese Exclusion Act, which was enacted in 1923 and repealed in 1947, she and her children were not allowed to come to Canada until the 50s, so they were apart for about 30 years. This was a great injustice, and so she spent most of her life uh, making Canadians aware of this, and because she was a test case, uh, the class action suit, it forced Canada to apologize. So in 2006, the Canadian government apologized for the head tax. It was the only race to which a head tax was applied. And she then was able to allow Canadians to know some of the past history. And knowing that, we know that it won't be repeated. And so she made Canada a better place. And we need to thank people like Chao Quen Lee for doing that.